By the way, you, you didn't get a doctor's prescription. You took this stuff, you bought stuff on the internet from right. an international pharmacy. Right. right. So you don't really know exactly what you were taking. I mean, it wasn't... Uh, I, I will definitely admit that. Right. I mean, but I did research it thoroughly. You know, I, I found that the company that made the drug I took in India actually has their, their plants in India approved by the FDA. Okay. And had you had feeling... I mean, when I saw this, mm -hmm. because I've done a lot of interviews with transgender people, and mm -hmm. I have friends who are transgendered, yeah. you know, they say, look, these are feelings that they don't come out of a bottle. It doesn't come right. out of a prescription bottle. It's, it's something that you've had for a long time. Right. Were you, did you have questions about your gender before? Um, n no, I had, I had never worn a piece of women's clothing. I, I have admitted publicly, you know, on my blog and in a couple other interviews that, you know, I told my ex-wife as I was going through this um, and my family, you know, I had questioned my sexuality a little bit when I was younger. I had, I did have an uncle that was gay. Um, and when I was younger, I just, I thought maybe, you know, more, I questioned if I was bisexual, but I decided I liked women. And but, but, but gender and sexuality are two very different exactly, things. Exactly, right. So it's, I, I just find it hard to understand or, or believe that all of a sudden you would want to start, that you would start to feel that you were meant to be a woman. Well, Anderson, I mean, the only thing I can say is, I mean, this um, was such, a life and death struggle for me. I, I went into severe depression, um, and I, in, by the time I got to 2011, you know, my marriage had ended, I was, I was living alone. Um, I was having physical feminization symptoms on my body, breast growth, um, you know, other symptoms like that. And emotionally, I was having female-type feelings as well. It stressed me out to no end, and I would have panic attacks several times I went to the emergency room. Later, um, you know, I, I thought that was the cause of all my problems. I, I accepted that I thought I was transgender and that it was stressing me out so much about coming out that I was having panic attacks.